How long has he been doing that? Exactly. Forever, I guess. Mother says when I was a baby, people tried to cut it and they wanted it for themselves. But once it's cut, it turns brown and loses power. A gift like that, it has to be protected. That's why Mother never let me. That's why I never left and. You never left that tower. And you're still gonna go back? No. Yes. It's complicated. Uh, yeah, well I'll tell you the sob story of poor orphan Eugene Fitzherbert. It's a little bit of a, a little bit of a downer. <laughs> there was this book, a book I used to read every night to all the younger kids. The Tales of Flanagan Rider, swashbuckling rogue, richest man alive, and not bad with the ladies either. Not that he ever bragged about it, of course. Was he a beat too? Uh, well, no. Actually, he had enough money to do anything he wanted to do. He could go anywhere that he wanted to go. And and for a kid with nothing, I just, I don't know, it just seemed like a better option. You can't tell anyone about this, okay? It could ruin my whole reputation. Who wouldn't want that? Well, a fake reputation is all a man has. <laughs> well, I should, um, I, I should, I should get some more firewood. Hey, for the record, I like Eugene Fitzherbert much better than Flynn Rider. Well, then you'd be the first. But thank you.